Okay, so here's what's going on. I'm on my couch, I'm watching Netflix, and all of a sudden, I look out my window, and there's just a fog that's covered the whole neighborhood. Like a clear, thick, white, just cloud that covered everything and I couldn't see. And I'm, I'm thinking, what is going on? I go back to the backyard, and it's just covered in fog. I can't see anything. And I realized I could either do two things. Be like, oh, this is really cool. I should maybe just, you know, maybe should get a picture. It could be cool for the gram. And, you know, that's it. And then go back to my couch and keep watching Netflix. Or I could do number two, which is go out and make stuff happen. And this is me making stuff happen. I don't know if you can see it, but look at this fog looks incredible. This is every photographer's dream. It's to like have these kind of conditions for your photos and your image. I mean, this is the stuff that I love taking because it's not the typical, you know, if I take a picture of this road in the daytime without fog, it would look fine. It's just a fine photo, but this fog makes it so much better. And so I guess today's video, and it's gonna be a quick video, super spontaneous, but it's all about getting up making stuff happen even if you don't want to that was me like 10 minutes ago and this is me making stuff happen so enjoy this video okay so i'm on my way to the location where i want to just take photos but check this out i'm in the middle of the road this fog it's like a ghost town this is so amazing like this this is just farmland this is where cows live it smells this road is boring, but without this fog, it makes it so much better. Get off your butt and start making crap happen. You're like, I don't have awesome photos. I don't get these cool images like my friends or videos. Well, you gotta start making, you gotta start creating. And I get so pumped because this stuff is just super cool. This is the stuff that separates the boys from the men, in my opinion, because no one wants to come out here. No one's out here. I haven't seen a car. No one, wa no one wants to come out here and actually shoot because Oh, it's not ideal conditions. Wrong. I'm lazy. Wrong. Oh, I'm too comfortable. I don't want to get off the couch. Wrong, wrong, wrong. And if you disagree with me, that's fine. But like, I'm getting phenomenal photos right now and I'm, I'm so pumped. <laughs> All right, let's go to the location. Drone shots, maybe. Will it get lost in the fog? Let's do it anyway. How epic were those shots? Seriously, like, this drone is seriously all wet <laughs> from all the fog. Freaking yes, that was so sweet. So now I'm just off to get some shots of like the railroad here. Uh, and I'm pretty pumped. Again, the fog just makes everything so much better. <sighs> and so I guess the moral of the story, if you will, essentially, you gotta stop being lazy and you gotta start creating. I know I keep saying that in like basically all of my videos, but that's something I live by only because stuff like this is what gets you to the next level. What you just saw there was me trying to actually take a photo by touching the screen and waiting 10 seconds. Hopefully getting a shot in focus. I don't know if it worked. I don't care, I'm gonna post those anyway because freaking awesome. <laughs> I'm inspired by those who do more in life, especially in the creative outlet of photography and video. Like those who just go out and take a risk, kind of like this, this really wasn't a risk, but it was more so the experience of getting better at the craft of photography. I know, wave it off, I'm good. People are so nice here, they're just stopping by and they're like, are you okay, are you, are you good? <laughs> I'm like, yes, I'm fine, I'm just filming. For example, like these pictures, will be beautiful, like I hope they are awesome. But those who go out and you know take risks and go out and actually have adventures like these or take out you know their camera and start taking photos in not so great conditions like rain or snow or fog in, you know, uh, with this scenario, like those kind of things sets you above everybody else only because no one's out here doing it. Like I don't see anybody else with a camera filming 
you know, taking drone shots. I'm sure somewhere else in the country or in the world they're doing that. But overall, I want to be the type of person with my craft and with my, you know, with my work to be creative. I want it to actually show that I care about what I do and I don't care where I'm at, what weather conditions are thrown at me. I'm gonna go out there and get the shot. Be brave to go out there and make mistakes. Film everything that you can, that's what I'm doing. I'm making mistakes all the time. My editing skills are, they're okay, but they're not phenomenal. And I'm not waiting to get phenomenal. I'm just wanting to get better in the process of every day. That's where most people lack and most people fail because they think I have to get things perfect. I have to get this shot just right. Even if it's out of focus, I still have to get it in focus. Yes, get your shots in focus, but that's not the whole point. Like the point is go out there and shoot. You know, get out of your room and start doing something. Start creating content for your page, YouTube channel, whatever it may be. Every single time a car comes by, I just, I think it's a cop and it's just the scariest thing. Like today, this point on, when you watch this video, you're out there creating, okay? This is your time to actually start doing something in 2019. Still have time to start hitting those goals. Start making them a reality. That's what I hope you guys get from this video. You know, not to just go bust your butts in extreme weather or extreme places and get yourself in trouble. That's not the point. The point is, just start creating. Keep on creating. Never stop. Always get better. And every now and then, get off your butt. Go get some awesome shots, some awesome video, film anything and everything. Keep getting better and never stop. Is that a cop? Is that a cop? Is that a cop? <sighs> not a cop. And with that being said, guys, Thank you so much for watching. Please let me know what you guys think in the comments below. I really want to know if you guys are like, like being creative every single day. If you're not, tell me how you're going to do it. I'm going to get back to my house, watch the Super Bowl, and I'll catch you next time on the John Q channel. Peace.